proud and excited for you. You have meant more to me than you will ever know. I'm continually encouraged and inspired by you and your quickness to love people without judgment or assumption. Though we all know I've never loved sharing you, I am so happy for you and excited to see you guys flourish in this new crazy season of marriage. I pray that your house be filled with copious amounts of love and laughter. I pray you would always keep the Lord in the center of your marriage and value him above all else. Now I will always be here for you. Jacob might get sick of me. <laughs> <laughs> which is probably guaranteed <laughs> but I love you guys and I'm so excited and I can't wait to see you grow congratulations <laughs> got to see Jacob's heart uh, for service um, and ultimately for following the Lord. Uh, and just It's been really inspiring to me to see, especially how honest and real his faith is. I mean, anytime that we have tough conversations or I, I see him having conversations with others, he's always very honest about his feelings and his thoughts. Um, and it's, just, it's a very genuine uh, faith, wrestling with tough questions. Um, he's been an inspiration to me, Jacob. I know we've, we've, we've gone back and forth at times. Jacob's come to me for, for help and uh, guidance and know that I've been inspired and encouraged by you just as much. So you've been really inspiring and a great part of my life. I know of your love for each other and your, your genuine and inspiring love for God that you both have. And so I'm excited to see uh, the many years ahead and what God has in store for you. Thank you guys. May God bless you. taking this voyage together. Even before the day, I worked up the courage to tell you that I loved you. I'd hoped for a future for us, God willing. A future not measured in months or years, but decades, lifetimes, and generations. A purpose to work towards. A future that has captivated our collective imagination for the last three years. But right now is where the timelines meet, where the future in our minds traces backwards through time to join hands with the all too slowly advancing past that's finally here. We made it there. But really, there's so much more of a story left to be told. We've just gotten to the part where the boy and the girl set sail and push off to sea. And the waves won't get any smaller, so we'll face them together and write the rest of the story. Six years ago, we met right here at Cannes, serving the ministry together, and three years ago, from the start, our relationship was founded on knowing and following God. I want our marriage and life together to continue in that way and be a blessing and example of God's love to everyone we meet. You're so good to me, Zoe. You're my favorite person to talk with for hours just about anything that's on our minds. And your strengths complement my weaknesses. You always know how to make me smile. And you have a song for every occasion. <laughs> You're my best friend, my teammate, and my lover. And I promise I will be the same for you. With love and sincerity and all that you have to offer. From the very last beat of this heart I'm gonna find a way home, don't you worry about your weary head, darling, we'll make it okay. I'll be a shield for you, shelter you, maybe I'll find a way. Cause I'm gonna keep you safe. Oh, safe. My love. This feels like an end and a beginning. No more cloud predictions or lack of covenant keeping us in Tuesday after day. We finally get to say goodbye to the goodbyes and spend the rest of our lives in close quarters and intimacy. And I'm guessing we're going to need to get a lot better at forgiving. <laughs> this is the daydream I have been dreaming for almost three years. 
sometimes interrupted by doubts and fears, but through every moment, you have been lying in the grass by my side, eyes closed with me as we tried to align our thoughts so that when we speak, we speak as one. You came to me out of nowhere, a pleasant surprise of a friendship that sat down next to me and didn't ask why it saw tears. The friendship that has grown slowly into a rock that we will build our family on and never have to worry about the rain coming down. I will love you and I will be your love. And I will never forget the love that our Father in Heaven has shown us when He gave us the gift of love itself, His Son. And my love won't be as perfect as His, but every day I promise I will love you again. And covenant is a big word. But as, in as much understanding as my mind can hold, I am making a covenant with you today. Before God, I stand here and say that I will honor you, support you, care for you, and make your dreams my dreams. I will strive towards the wife that I have been created to be. And what is imperfect will be made perfect in his sight. Just as we are redeemed, so may our marriage be. And the peace I am given in this spans any distance we could walk together on this earth. I have longed for you like a voyager longs for home, and I am blessed beyond measure to be coming home to you today, after all this time at sea, with love and sincerity and all that I have to offer. Thank <laughs> you.